welcome back to my channel, our channel, whatever it is, Simba's channel. My channel. Yeah. If you've seen by the title today, we are doing a bit of a MasterChef um, doggy treat bake off today. Not really. We're just going to be having some fun, making some lockdown treatos for Simi. I've been inspired by some recipes that I have found, so I've kind of just adapted it to what I personally would do. All oh, right, inspiration ideas. Okay, mummy's really boring. And then at the end, we're gonna do a big taste test and get Simba's honest review of the treats, um, which ones he likes best, and what you rate it out of 10. What do you think? Does that sound like a good plan? Yeah. Yeah. Treato number one is going to be turkey and veggie meatballs. Whoa. And then we are making peanut butter cookies. Yeah. And then we are making doggy donuts. They are all human friendly treats, Ooh, just maybe by the I'll way. I'll just eat them all. I don't think they're gonna be like really good for human. I don't know, they might not taste as good, but as they're good, gonna yeah. be incredible for Simba. Let's get started with the first one, which is gonna be the turkey and veggie meatballs. Yeah. Four ingredients, let's go. All right, first things first, preheat your oven. We've got um, fan force, so I'm gonna go about 200 to 220. That's gonna be what I'm using for all of these recipes today. All right, so cool. first thing we are going to use is this turkey mince. This is 400 grams. We've also got some frozen pre-cut vegetables. This is carrots, peas, and corn. Then we're going to use two large eggs and also just a bit of parsley. This is actually from last week's HelloFresh that we didn't use. So let's start off by combining everything into a bowl. Another restless night I can't stop dreaming of you Always got me in a spin Yeah, you never make me blue Thinking about the way you walk To the way you call my name we are on to recipe number two. So the turkey balls are in the oven and I've put them in there for 20 minutes. But the next one, while we are waiting for those to cook, are the peanut butter Biscuits. And, a butter and I thought we could do some really cute designs. When we flatten them, we could make like little paw prints. So what you're going to need is two cups of wholemeal self-raising flour, half a teaspoon of ground cinnamon, half a cup of water, half a cup of water, sorry, a quarter of a cup of peanut butter, a one egg and two teaspoons, oh, two tablespoons, re re redo it, two tablespoons do of coconut oil. Do it all in one now. Go. Wholemeal flour. Ground cinnamon. How many? Water. How much water? Half Dinner. a cup. Quarter of a cup of peanut butter. One egg. Uh, two tablespoons of oil. It's like I didn't even study acting. I should be remembering my lines. Yeah, I know, man. Anyway, so we mix all the dry ingredients and then chuck in the wet ingredients, mix it all together, pop it on a um, lime baking tray. Give it, a, give it a whirl. Oh, I feel dizzy. Why do you feel dizzy? Another restless night, any other one to blame It always makes me sad to say goodbye at the end of the night But y'all be on my mind way past the morning light That's alright, another restless night Just dreaming about those things you do Another restless night, another cause by you Alrighty, so the biscuits have just gone in the oven. The turkey balls are nearly done. So as we get the donuts in the oven, the turkey ones will be ready to come out. They've been in there for 20 minutes, but I think we're gonna leave them in there for 25. And same thing with the biscuits. We've just popped them in there for 25 minutes. So the next one is doggy donuts. It is very similar ingredients to the biscuits, but just a little bit more. And we're doing a little frosting as well. So what you're gonna need is two bananas. We're gonna start by mashing them in the bowl. We're gonna need some peanut butter, some for the mixture and some for the frosting. For the mixture, we need a quarter of a cup. 
And then for the frosting, another quarter of a cup. Quarter of a cup of melted coconut oil. Two teaspoons of honey. One egg. Oh, could you grab one egg? One cup of wholemeal flour. And half a teaspoon of baking powder. Then for the frosting, you're going to need half a cup of Greek yogurt. So I just bought this one that's literally going to be half a cup in itself, which is great. And then that's going to get mixed in with the peanut butter for the frosting. It always makes me sad to say goodbye at the end of the night. But y'all be on my mind way past the morning light. That's all right, another restless night. Just dreaming about those things you do. Oh, another restless night, another cause by you. You're the only one to ever make me feel this right. I wanna wrap my arms around you. Oh, baby, you know just what I like. Another restless night. Just dreaming about those things you do Another restless night, another cause by you Okay, so this kid is getting a gourmet meal cooked and he wants to go and eat his own poop. That's homemade gourmet food and you want to eat shit. Nice one. Busted. The whole internet knows your secret now. These have a very scone-like texture. Kind of crumbly. A really mm. basic complaint. I don't know. I like the taste of wholemeal flour. I think it... I think it's really nice. That does just smell like scone. I feel like this would be really good with jam. Yeah. We oh. could have added cheese into that and that could have been our cheese scones. Jam and cream with this would be good. Mm. P.S. The little paw prints didn't really work. Simba, are you ready for a taste test of all your new treaties? We're gonna set up a little table for Simba to do his taste test. Yeah, we're gonna see what he thinks. All right, first one. Here we go. I think so. I like it. So we've got his kangaroo balls that he usually has with dinner, leave it, and the one we made. Leave it. Okay. okay. Picked out first. <laughs> Good boy. Leave it. Should I break it? Sure. <laughs> oh my gosh. Good boy. Oh, yummy. Okay. Is it yum? Emergency water? Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. Half a donut. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, guys, the final test is which Trito did he like the best? We've got half a donut, half a cookie, and a veggie and turkey ball. Torture. Okay. Vicky. Oh my God. <laughs> he does not need dinner. <laughs> Do you want a lick? Oh, <laughs> done. You don't need food. any more snacks. What do you say? Thanks so much for watching everyone. I hope you guys liked this video, found it entertaining or found it a little bit useful. If you would like to follow Simba on Instagram, it is at the Simba Davis. I did just want to do a quick disclaimer. Obviously not all dogs are the same, but this stuff is all fine for Simba to eat. He's obviously absolutely loving it. If you do make any treats for your dog, please check the ingredients and just make sure everything is fine for them. And just be probably aware of of how much they can eat in a day. Mm -hmm. He's young, he's growing, 
he probably won't have that much dinner tonight because that was a lot of food. <laughs> He's had a whole donut. Wow. Two Vickies and a few of those balls. This is just for a fun video. He doesn't get this stuff every day. And we'll probably eat most of this. We will. <laughs> He's not gonna, oh my gosh, stuff. he wants it so bad. If you guys enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up down below and subscribe if you haven't already. Hit the post notification so you don't miss when we upload. My name is Jess. I make new videos every Tuesday and Friday. So I will see you on Friday.